other day I posted a video on how to list files in directories in Python and we used a uh, two modules called uh, fnmatch and the OS module and uh, someone uh, posted a uh, tugga3d is the user's name so tugga3d uh, posted a uh, another way of doing it which is a little bit shorter you only have to import one module and it's definitely a shorter code so it's a simpler way more efficient way in in some aspects so I thought I'd share that with you today so I'm going to go um, into let, let's let's quickly just make something to work with here I'll make a directory I'll just call it uh, PL for Python list I guess and I'll go in there and I'll just create a few empty files I'll call them file.txt file2.txt 3.txt my file.txt my file.png jpeg uh, png so now if I list out I have just some empty files that we can play with and look at here so now I'm going to start up Python we've got uh, I'm running Python 2.71 and uh, this is the way it's done import the module called glob and then all you have to do is glob dot glob and then inside parentheses inside quotations what you want to list if we want to list them all we'll just put a little asterisk in there boom and it lists all the files uh, in a nice little list there that uh, actually is easier to manipulate than the other way which I, if I remember correctly just printed them out could be wrong about that uh, anyway um, if we want to list just PNGs, we can list just PNGs. If we want to list uh, just text files, we can just list just text files. And we can also just list all files that start with my. Of course, if you want to do another directory, you can do another directory like I can do um, my root directory. Now, if you just put the forward slash, it just doesn't list the, the root directory. But if you do forward slash asterisk, it'll list everything in the root directory. And you can do other folders like home. My home folder is LX1000. There we go. So that's it. I thought I'd give you a little update on that. Uh, please check the first link in the description. I'll have a post there on this. And uh, please visit filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with a K. And I hope that you have a great day. And once again, thank you, uh, Tugga3D.